Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I am going to show you how to fix iPhone stuck on Apple logo without losing data. As you can see here I have an iPhone 7 which is currently stuck on Apple logo. Now I can fix this phone by restoring it with iTunes but restoring will erase everything from my iPhone which I don't want because most of my iPhone data are not backed up yet. And here's what happened with this phone. Last night I was getting notification of software update and I tapped on update and when I woke up in the morning I found my phone in this situation and I'm quite sure it happened while downloading and installing the update. If you have same problem then in this video I'm going to show you an easiest way to fix it. So let's get started. In order to fix your iPhone problem you will need to use a software by the name of iMyPhone Fix Pro. You can get the software from the link given in the description below. The software is available for Windows as well as Mac users. So just go ahead download and install the software. Link will be right in the description below. After that open it up. As you can see this software gives you two options to fix your iPhone's software problem. First option is standard mode. With this mode you can fix the following problems without losing your data. We can fix the problems like iPhone is stuck on black or white screen, iPhone is stuck on Apple logo, iPhone is not turning on, iPhone is frozen and more. And the second option is advanced mode. If standard mode couldn't fix your problem then you need to switch to advanced mode which will 100% fix your problem but it will erase data from your iPhone. So I'm just gonna go with standard mode. Now click on next. Now you need to get your phone into DFU mode. This software will tell you how you can get your phone into DFU mode and the instructions are given separately for all the iOS devices. So in my case my iPhone is iPhone 7 or plus so I'm gonna need to follow this instruction. If your iPhone is iPhone 8 or later then follow these steps. If your iPhone is iPhone 6 or older then you need to follow this step. Once your phone is connected to computer with DFU mode, now you need to download latest firmware for your iOS device. According to the software, I should download iOS version 12.3 or 12.2. You can select whichever option you want. After that, click on download and it's gonna start downloading the firmware for your device. Downloading process will take time depending on your internet connection. So I'm just gonna cancel it because I've already downloaded the firmware for my iOS device. In case you have a firmware available on your computer, then click on select. Now select the firmware. Next click on start. And it's gonna start fixing your iPhone's problem. During this process, do not disconnect your phone. Just leave your phone as it is. Now you can see the process is completed. Now you should have your phone fixed without losing your important data. Now all you need to do is set up your phone as if it is brand new. Now let me set up my phone quickly. Now enter the passcode which you were using before the problem. Now type your Apple ID password if you have. If you don't, just skip it. Okay, now let's see. Okay, all my photos are there fortunately as you can see now let me go to my contacts do I have my contacts yes all my contacts are there okay my notes are also there I had a lot of music on my iPhone but music are not important what important was for me the messages contacts and the photos which are fortunately there as you saw, I got my problem fixed with standard mode. If your problem is not fixed, then you need to try advanced mode. It will erase all the data from your phone, but it will definitely fix the problem. While using the software, if you face any kind of problem or if you have any question, then you should contact the software's support team. To do that, just click on this message button and type your email address. After that type your message and click on submit. So there you have it guys. That is how you can fix iPhone stuck on iPhone logo problem without losing your important data. 
please let me know what you think about this video in the comment section below and if you enjoyed this video then please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to share it with your friends and if you want more videos like this then please subscribe to my channel with notification on and i'll catch you on the next one have a wonderful day